testosterone propionate. Now there seems to be some discussion about using this ester in the TRT community and this may work for some but not others. Well firstly let's think about its half-life. It's a very short ester with a half-life of anywhere between 1.5 to 4 days depending on what source you find. However what's more important to consider with propionate is its Tmax or that time to peak plasma concentration level. This is only four to six hours. Now this is a very short amount of time for being what's known as systemically active. This makes it a potentially poor choice for TRT as a standalone option, as we're trying to achieve steady state that we discussed earlier. When you're dealing with a medication that has such a short Tmax and half-life, it makes it very temperamental when dosing adjustments are made. You get these big peaks and then these big troughs, which can be seen quite clearly in the example on screen here. Now, some do not get on well with this, as for most, we're trying to achieve that steady state. Now, we can try to mitigate for this by administering daily, and then you'll look something like this, and you'll see it on the screen in terms of levels in theory. However, due to that short Tmax and half-life, you may not get these types of results, and when adding in the multiple variables that we all as individual human beings have, it's, it's a difficult compound to use alone to achieve stability.